it's Tech Boy here, and I got a, a review for you guys today. Uh, today I got this uh, really cool carbon fiber pocket knife. Um, in concept, a carbon fiber pocket knife seems really cool. They look good. They're lightweight, uh, durable. Well, let's see what the reality is of a carbon fiber pocket knife. So. The people that make this knife are um, Benchmark, quality knives since 1976. And uh, here's the box that came in. <clears throat> Pretty nice box. There's the back. There's the bottom. Warning, this product contains chemical, contains a chemical or substance known to the state only to California to cause cancer and birth defects or other reproductive harm. Okay, that's interesting. And... That's the box. Okay. Has a nice presentation. And there it is. Isn't that gorgeous? Um, so, yeah. Here's a carbon fiber pocket knife. Nice, nice presentation. Very nice box. But the main part is the knife. So, here's the knife. Um, folds in like that. First impressions when you're holding it is very, very light. Uh, very light. Oopsies, daisies. And it's a very light knife. It has a very nice clip on it. A nice clip, very stiff clip. So, and it's really, really light. You look closely at it. Let's zoom in. That is 100% real carbon fiber. Um, it doesn't have a glossy finish on it, so that is straight up carbon fiber. Um, it's got an interesting feel to it, a strange smell, it's probably the cancer thing known in California that they're talking about, but whatever. Goes out like that, you have benchmark on there, and there's that beautiful carbon fiber blade. Still, a very light knife, and it can't fling out, it's not heavy enough to fling out or anything like that, it's kind of stiff, so you kind of have to open it up like that, but it looks really cool, it's a really cool looking knife, that carbon fiber is something else, okay, let's get a better look at this, there we go, it's just really cool looking. There's the blade. Now, usability of the knife. Well, okay, first let's go over some more features. That little uh, thumb push thing there, it's uh, not the grippiest one. Um, more for looks. I'm going to be honest with you, this knife is for looks. Functionality isn't that great because carbon fiber is not, in this form, is not a durable, uh, durable thing. Um, I've cut boxes with this, paper related things, and as you can see, hold on, the blade is chipping. It's not durable. It's a very lightweight knife, and that lightweight does not lightweight does not transfer into any sort of durability or sharpness. I have no problem doing this with my finger. It's not sharp at all not sharp so it looks sweet but it doesn't really work that well it's not sharp maybe for cut I've cut a few boxes open and it's chipped the blade already it's not a usable knife it really isn't um, but for looks and making people go huh that's a sweet looking knife uh, it works it's something to own you get to say you own a carbon fiber knife, and you get to show people, and they're like, wow, that's really light. Um, it has a little bit of flex in it. It's, it's, this is a well-built knife as being put together-wise, but the materials, carbon fiber is just not a good material to use as a, as a knife. Stick to metal uh, and stick to ceramic. I might get a ceramic knife and do a review on that too, so you might want to subscribe. Alright, well, thanks for watching. This isn't a knife meant for outdoor use. It's, uh, it's a knife meant for looks to put on a shelf to keep in this box. <laughs> so.
to, to keep in this box. So, yeah, there you go. It looks really nice sitting in that box. Not really a usable knife at all. So, thanks for watching. That's my review of the Benchmark Carbon Fiber Knife. Um, is subscribe if you want more reviews. I do reviews on random stuff I get, mainly electronics, and I do computer builds as well. Uh, help support your channel. Uh, if you want to get this knife, I have a link down in the description f to Amazon. And shop, uh, if you use that link to shop for anything. I get a little kickback from Amazon whenever you buy anything. And that helps my channel out, out a bit so you don't get crappy videos so I can improve my videos. Like get a microphone, for instance. So, I'm Tech Boy. Thanks for watching and subscribe.